Hey everybody, Cypherboy here, and welcome to the game Kingdoms of Alamar Reckoning. Without further ado, let's begin. I'll do normal for this gameplay. I played this on my main account for my PS3, but this one this account is for Cypherboy Gaming, so everything is pretty new at the moment. I haven't played this game in a while, so I may need some refreshers, but luckily it has the tutorials turned on right now. From the beginning, we were wrong, and only now, well into the second decade of the conflict, have we begun to understand the mistakes we have made. We lived in harmony among the Fey, in a world awakened to new magic. Perhaps we should have foreseen what might be born on this rising tide. What force might awaken. A force powerful enough to twist even the eternal and immutable Fey folk. <laughs> But Gadflo, the new king of the Winter Court, surprised us all. Singular among his people, he was all that other Fae were not. Aggressive, ambitious, visionary. He had power like none we had ever seen. Terrible and deadly. Gadflo and his followers, the Tuatha Deon, believed that a new god was to be born in the east, beneath Gadflo's crystalline fortress of Amethyn. In the name of that god, they marched to war against the young races of Amalur. Against a mortal army, no matter the power of their god, we might have been victorious. But the Fey are creatures of magic, not bound by the laws of life and death. Each Tuatha fallen on the battlefield would soon rise again, for the Fey do not know death as we do. How could we stand against such a force? For ten years the war raged, for ten years the armies of men and Alpha fought and died. But as our numbers dwindled, we knew that it was only a matter of time. Our fate had been written, at least, that is what we believed, until you died. What do you think this one is then? Alpha? Dorani? Could even be a Jotun. Always a surprise, eh, Garan? Eyes on the job, boy. Don't matter what it is. Dead's dead. And be thankful for that. All we've seen. Go on and pull back the sheet, though. It'll need to be in our report, one way or the other. So now is the character creation. Let's see.
Okay, I think I'm going to choose this hairstyle. I chose blonde for my icon on the um, YouTube. Let's go see what facial hair is there. Let's see. Um, I actually like the clean shaven look. Let's go with the eyebrow color. That looks good. Let's do skin tone. A little bit more peachy color and normal. Um, yeah, I like that one. Cannot really see the eyes very well, but going for it. Want to go for a light color. Maybe that would be it. I don't know for sure. don't think he has double or yeah he does let's do that can we get rid of it all together though yep there we go let's go with accessories jewelry Let's go with, let's see, maybe that one, looking like Zell from Final Fantasy VIII with that tattoo and the hairstyle. No, that was, that's even more like Zell. I like that one. Okay, let's see. Let's give um so hard to choose. Yeah, you know what? Let's do that one. That color to make it a little bit more subtle, I think. See how intense it can go. Lighten it up a little bit. There we go, that's good.
He's a Dokulfar. <laughs> no surprise there. Seen a lot of them. Though not usually in this good a shape. All right then. Make sure it goes into the report. <laughs> you know he'll, know he'll want all the details. Amazing how well the body held up. Better than I've seen. I'm just glad it's not moving. Must have been born under a lucky star, this one. Anything else we need? Unless you'd like to name him, I think we're done. Put him with the others. That's right, we're all dead. Oh, I kind of like that one. Carolyn. Now let's go ahead and go with that. I was going to do Cypher like most of my other characters, but this time I like that one. Name here too much. So we're going to go with that one. Looks kind of Gaelic to me. Well, that's it for you then. Better luck next time. Experiment disposal. Secrecy is still important in our work, requiring specialized disposal of our unfortunate failures. Piling remains have become a concern of, in the lower caverns, where an incinerator has been added to deal with the waste. This should make disposal work slightly less horrible, although you should avoid drinking water from downstream of the ash dumps. Hardly a fitting rest for the poor things, but it's if it's any consolation. These weren't their original bodies in the first place. Formerous Hughes. Okay, so... Bye-bye. Into the fire he went. Take all. Press start. Inventory. Weapons. Uh, let's equip this to the primary. There we go. Quests. Find a way out. I woke up in a pile of corpses somewhere deep underground. I have no memory of who I am and no clue where I am. I need to find a way out of here. They're all over! Run! <coughs> Scatter, children of dust! Scatter before the might of the Tuatha! They need help, so let's press X to attack. Can we take it? 
take anything from them. I don't Stay know. away. I think so. Let's go this way. I don't remember if anything is the other way, like loot or something. Should have gone that way first. Okay, that's. Snowed off, so let's go this way. So that's the rat things. No child of dust shall escape. Help anybody. Got to find you first. You up there, please help me! Please! More mortal scum? To dodge, okay. Come along. I... Wait. I've seen you before. On the slab. You. You were dead. It worked. By the tome, it worked. You're alive. What happened to me? 